right? For this one, we're gonna do the peach nectar. Habanero peach. Whiskey sour. So, I'm gonna do this one a little different. Uh, I'm gonna throw some ice in my tin. But again, I'm gonna use two ounces of the light, the legendary white because it's going to be single spirit only. Drop it in. You got your lemon? You got your lemon juice? You got your half ounce of lemon juice? Right? You got your half ounce of lemon juice? Got it? Good. Now you're going to swap that out. See this habanero syrup? This is a uh, this is only good for about two weeks. So I got it dated 825. Anytime you make your own syrups or nectars or juices or whatever, date it. Uh, I didn't date this because I'm gonna use it all. I didn't date this because what I don't use, I'm gonna drink right now. But this habanero syrup, I got about two weeks to use this. So I'm gonna use a half ounce of the habanero syrup. All right, now we're gonna shake it up. And we're going to use a Collins glass. We're not going to use a we're not going to use a rocks glass on this. We're going to use a Collins glass since there's going to be a little bit more fluid in it. A little bit, not much. Um, so you got that. Now what you want to do is you want to fill that with some peach nectar, and that's it. That's your habanero peach uh, whiskey sour. There it is, it's got a little bit of a bite uh, on the end. If you guys are out there making the, uh, if you guys are out there making the peach legendary, do that and use that for that and the peach nectar, it's great. Um, if you're not, just use, infuse some peaches into your legendary. Um, and if that doesn't have the kick you want or the bite you want, uh, you may want to let that habanero either add a little bit more there's no spirits in that, so you're good. You don't have to worry about getting wasted off of the habanero syrup. Um, just add a little bit more syrup to that. So, that, that, next we're gonna do our twist on the amaretto sour.